Hello my dear friends welcome back to Infigyan. Today in this video we are going to solve one very very interesting quadratic equation problem. Here we have one unknown a also. Given that a belongs to real numbers. So let's get started. We are going to calculate x in terms of a for sure. Let me simplify our LHS. I will write x power 4 minus 10x cube minus 2 a x square plus 22 x square plus 10 a x plus 12 x plus 2 a plus a square equal to 0. Now we will write our LHS expression as a quadratic expression in a. So I can write a square I will take minus a common from these three terms. So I can write in the bracket 2x square minus 10x minus 2. Then we have four terms left. x power 4, the very first one, minus 10x cube. Then we have 22x square. Then we have 12x equal to 0. Now I will compare this equation with the equation a a square plus b a plus c equal to 0. So we can compare the coefficients and write a equal to 1, b equal to minus of 2x square minus 10x minus 2 and we will write c equal to x power 4 minus 10x cube plus 22x square plus 12x. This is the value of a, b and c. Now we will apply quadratic formula to calculate a, a small a. So I can write here a small a equal to minus b plus minus a square root of let me write d discriminant over 2 times a. Here d is b square minus 4 times ac. Now we have to apply all the values. Here we have the values of a, b and c. So I can write discriminant d equal to b square. So minus a square is plus. I will write directly 2x square minus 10x minus 2 whole square. Minus 4 times a is 1. C is x power 4. So let us write x power 4 minus 10x cube plus 22x square plus 12x. Now we will expand a plus b plus c whole square a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ca. Let's apply a square will give us 4x power 4. b square will give us 100x square. c square will give us 4. Then 2ab term. So we will write here minus 2 times 2 is 4. 4 times 10 is 40. 40 x cube. 2bc will give us plus 40x, 2ca will give us minus 8x square. Then we will multiply the last bracket with minus 4 and we can write minus 4x power 4 plus 40x cube minus 88x square minus 48x. Now we are going to cancel the terms which we can. So 4x power 4 minus 4x power 4 minus 40x cube plus 40x cube will be over. Now 100x square minus 8x square minus 88x square. So 100x square minus 96x square will give us 4x square. Then we have 40x minus 48x, we will be writing minus 8x. 
then plus 4 is only left. Now we can take 4 common. So I can write 4 times in the bracket x square minus 2x plus 1. So this is nothing but 4 times x minus 1 whole square. This is the value of d. Now we will apply here. So we can write a will be equal to a small a will be equal to minus b. So minus of minus. So I can write directly plus in the bracket 2x square minus 10x minus 2 plus minus a square root d. So d was 4 times x minus 1 whole square over 2 times a which is 2 times 1. This is a equal to minus b plus minus a square root d over 2 times a. Now we have to only simplify. I will write a small a will be equal to 2x square minus 10x minus 2 plus minus. A square root and a square will be over. We will write 2 times x minus 1 over 2 times 1 is 2. Now we can write after division x square minus 5x minus 1 plus minus x minus 1. So I can write x square minus 5x minus 1 plus x minus 1 and x square minus 5x minus 1 minus x plus 1. So minus 1 and plus 1 will be over from here. So we can write x square minus 6x here. And here I will be writing x square minus 4x minus 2. So x square minus 4x minus 2 equal to a and x square minus 6x equal to a. Let me write here x square minus 4x minus 2 equal to a and x square minus 6x equal to a. So we will write here two quadratic equations. Take all the terms to LHS, x square minus 4x, then I can write minus 2 minus a or minus of a plus 2 equal to 0. Now we will use quadratic formula here, x will be equal to minus b, so minus of minus 4 plus minus a square root of b square minus 4 square is 16 minus 4 times 1 times minus of a plus 2. I will write plus 4 times a plus 2. In denominator, we will write 2 times 1. This will give us 4 plus minus a square root of 16 plus 4a plus 8 over 2 times 1 is 2. Or I can write 4 plus minus a square root of 4a plus 24 over 2. Now we will take 4 common from the radicant expression. We will write 4 plus minus. It will come out as 2. So I will write 2 here. In this a square root, we will write a plus 6 over 2. Or I can write our first two solutions 2 plus minus a square root of a plus 6. Now we have to solve x square minus 6x equal to a. Let me write here x square minus 6x equal to a or x square minus 6x minus a equal to 0. Let's apply quadratic formula x equal to minus b so minus of minus 6 plus minus a square root of b square so minus 6 a square minus 4ac so we can write plus 4a 4 times 1 times minus a will be equal to plus 4a 
over 2 times 1, so 2, equal to 6 plus minus a square root of 36 plus 4a over 2. Now 36 plus 4a, 4 we can take common out, it will come out as 2. In a square root we will write a plus 9, denominator is 2. So we can get here 3 plus minus a square root of a plus 9. So we have the remaining two solutions. Let me write in total x1 will be equal to 2 plus a square root of a plus 6. x2 will be equal to 2 minus a square root of a plus 6 x3 will be equal to 3 plus a square root of a plus 9 and we will write our fourth solution x4 equal to 3 minus a square root of a plus 9. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.